Welcome back to the Roots Trees Are Dead. A detective email filling out a family tree. The goal of this video is to go from 18 people on the family tree found to 33. So I've been looking at this plane crash search in this little search engine thing and looking up the Root Tree curse. Mm, the plane crash. Yes, icy storm. Is the Root Tree curse a real thing? Oh my gosh! <laughs> But this is actually like it, it gives in, in neat information though, fake like and, and yes conspiracy website whatever. But we get Ernie Madsen Jr. This raft. Hmm. We have the picture Operation Helicopter Land. Thomas Overwood. My gosh, it's like a stupid magic trick. Track the the current year whatever. Nope. Three of the five prisoners have died mysteriously. Car got hit by a drunk driver, but nobody was arrested. Hmm. Also, a nice time cube reference. Uh, on the root tree curse, I, I don't think, like, well, first of all, Chris Raff, that's interesting. It looks like Rafferty, except we don't have Chris Rafferty. We have Clark Rafferty. So, I'll just put that in. Nothing. Um, okay. What is prodigy.net? with the service um anyway oh i got something that's a lot wow those noises were notifications that i got at the bottom um okay let's zoom back out now uh beyonce uh lulu oh, third cousin that's really far oh, we, we're back to freaking hieroglyphics on the left i see okay so we got a lot of new photos up here cousins up oh. Scrambled. All right. Oh my gosh. You gotta re <laughs> unscramble this. Okay. <laughs> the first. Um. Okay. And two. Okay. Here we go. I. That is. That's Davy, right? Because that's the male name. The only male name of the three. Third cousins is really far away. Let's see, Lulu. Wait. Is there? Hold on. There might be only one place that fits because Clark Rafferty, then, oh wait, I still don't know whether uh, Chris's second wife, uh, but this, I believe, would be where Chris Rafferty goes as well as fiance. We don't have a Lulu here, but we have Louisa, I guess that's the closest one. That's Davy, but we don't know where the in position they would be. She's, okay, here. All right, looks like we got it. self portrait oh, hi. Well, that's nice. All right. And no more extra pictures. Okay. Yeah, the typo is, I guess, intentional. College. Oh, by the way, college student. There we go. So that's confirmed now. Uh, apart from that, we also have this information about Davy, uh, Davy and Bethany. And this is information about their family trees. So Davy, then Bethany, and then Stephanie. That doesn't actually narrow it down as much as I'd like. Like, I'm pretty sure only child fits in here and here as well. Mm. As for Root Tree Curse, we have Operation RT... What the hell is that? More conspiracy theories. Changing the candy recipe. <laughs> Nearly... Uh... Lol. Seems real. Hmm. Emulsifier... Okay. No rel wow, okay. I remember this next president guy Hudson thing. Oh, oh, we got, okay, great. Fancy flavors, I've never seen this text, so. Hmm. Fancy flavors. Caviar, limited flavor, uh huh. Oh, fancy flavors. Alright, well. That doesn't seem actually that useful. Somehow that campaign mailer is a 13 on it. That means it has 13 references to other things, so I should look at it. Interesting. I thought it wasn't very relevant right now, but maybe it is. Butler County Times. A video game. That's a paper. And has articles about the Rootstree family and we only have access to it now? <laughs> okay. Um, what about Stephanie Jones? No mention of the Roosters ever having endorsed. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Stephanie Jones. A distant cousin of the Roosters. 
and deforestation of trees. So this is a fail about the root trees. Why is it like any other root tree in here? Oh, come on. Like, I would expect to see a lot of other root trees in here. Offhand, quite a lot. Ernie Jr. You okay, fifth president. I mean, I think we already knew that, but nice to know. Finally. Mm, yep, okay. What about Elias C. Root Tree? Nope. No, nothing for Robert Root Tree. Ah. Mm. Yeah, I... Advertisement. It seems like this is not that relevant. We can't... Leave legal troubles behind, though. Interesting. My gosh. Let's go with the Clance Trust. Oh, we got something for Lauren. Yes, I... Okay, that's not really relevant, is there? I guess we have some romance books that I haven't looked up yet, but at the same time, that feels not very relevant. Brother Clan C, I think we already knew that. Fort Jester, why? I guess we need to use the sequel name, if there is one. Nope, no, no results for two. Alright, maybe this is a dead end. Oh, the magazine Teen Black. I don't think I've ever seen that one. I didn't search that up at all. Let's do that. Okay, a periodicals. Okay. Freaking, this, this should have been done way earlier, I imagine, because Rain and Root Tree is an early thing there. I imagine I'm gonna get, like, the other picture. Okay. Hold on, nope. Text. Team Blast. Okay. So Rain is on the cover, and that, we're gonna add it there. Yeah. <laughs> we have the access to that very early on. Oh, this, um... Okay, so... Grandpa was a college professor, and Grandma Laura... But, I don't mean Clancy was not the pre- I don't freaking know. I thought Carl had, was a dis direct, like, past- I don't know. But sure, Professor. When did I, where did I get Deborah from? I guess, I don't know. Also, this text at the very beginning got married to TMS. Who the hell is that? Right. I put that in without even freaking filling in Reyna's marriage. This, okay, yeah, none of this relevant. None of that is relevant at all. But I should have marked that- here. Thomas Sheridan, there we go. You know, it's annoying to me that I can't just do like James Root Tree's father and get anything. Instead, I get that instead. Wonderful. So, uh, there's only two other divorce. Like, here's a divorce. Um, and I think this means the this is after they divorce. And you can see the tree ends there. There's also one on this side that leads into a divorce. And I think that might be the one that's relevant here. Now, I don't understand this part yet. Basically, I think this is the place to put it. Um, Stephanie here, who was born Landon. Who well, guess the politician? Politics? Married to Brian Jones. And Mother Carolyn. Er, Carolyn is not in here. Oh, here, Morden. All right, hold on. I guess that makes sense, but I would have thought Landon. Well, that would mean that they took the name Mark Landon, right? The, the two last name of that. And then we, we take a picture. Okay. And might as well take this picture too. Brian Jones. Okay. Hmm. So searching Brian Jones gives this thing about the Jones graphic and print. So let's search that one. The printing staple for years, supposedly. It's a fancy... We also do web design. It's apparently, like, a lot of the sites we've visited, the description says this this web design is not that good, so it's kind of funny to have that. Oh, wait. This is actually a list of, like, websites that I can visit now. That's a lot of info, actually. What's Root Tree Motors? Ah, for... Although, other places... Let's check that. Okay, got something. Three unique versions of the ad. Wilkins Motors. Okay. Here. 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 Who's that? Te Tessa Root Tree. Their newest fixer, huh? Okay. Hmm. But has joined the Root Tree family. Okay. Wilkins Motors used to be called that. The older ads aren't relevant, but the name change might be relevant. Let's search for Wilkins Motors, no relevant results, whatever. Okay. Oh, how can pressing back does that? Rude. What about this thing? School district. Really? 
Thanks, Spaghetti Monster. What about the Summer Theater? Maybe it comes um in the... No, okay. Hmm. In November? Wait a minute. Wait. We've seen the word November before in, uh, not there. So in Childish Writing, it says November. I don't know if that's relevant, because I thought it was just a month. You'd think it was just a month, but maybe it's not. So what's this? Local dance, and that's local. I, I guess if it's local, then it'll probably go in here. I'm not sure. No mention studios. <laughs> okay. Amazing. Uh, we, we also want to find maybe the summer theater. And been around for at least 30 years and... Oh, great. That's freaking useless. Thanks, Spaghetti Monster. What about the district? Nothing. Oh my gosh. Lol. <laughs> like to search Catherine Wilkins. No, god damn it. Gosh. You'd think these freak one of these freaking names in the list would come up with something. Is Carolyn Morden in there? Okay, newspaper clipping. All right. So the picture on the front page, a sculpture and a book. Okay, so unfortunately I, I can't put a picture there, which is weird. Probably a bit of a sign I got something wrong. Here we go. That's all? Okay, that's a sculpture. <laughs> okay, so I bet then that we were actually supposed to put this in here. Okay, but then who is... This is not making sense, like... Maybe Mark was uh, here instead, and then had nothing to do with the adoption or whatever. I guess some um, book means author? No? I don't know. Oh, Mother Carol, a local artist. Okay, there we go. Alright. Great. Okay, it's great to have those being removed, um, you know, that removed, there you go. It's, it's nice to see that at the very end, we're probably gonna have very little, uh, names and pictures left to scroll through, because my gosh, there were too many at the start. Okay, the site's glitching again, but, oh my gosh, can't even read it. Okay, that's a lot, that's very, okay, we need to copy this, basically, because that's so much. And we got Alois, too. Um, but yeah, Sister Gwendolyn, Cousin Bonnie... Father Zach, yeah, huh? Definitely okay, so we confirm that now. Marriage to Mark, yes, okay. So it said Sister Gwendolyn in there, which means, well, weren't there multiple people that were kind of named Gwyn? Hmm. Maybe this was Gwendolyn, but Root Tree instead. And then married a Morden. And cousin Bonnie, so one of those is probably Bonnie. So also the sculpture name is called Atlantis Burden, and nothing, goddammit. What is Brother Trouble? This is in the Teen Blast thing. I. What is that? Hmm. What? Ron Rootry? That I... RR Productions. Does that have anything to do with Rootry's versus RR? And Robbie Rootry. <laughs> the rumor about Robbie Rootry. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, Spaghetti Monster. Okay. That seems ran from okay. The new magazine, but does, doesn't this seem relevant? Especially this thing with the RR, the alliteration. Gambling habit, allegedly. So are they brothers? Paris again, like we've seen Paris as well. Gwyn and the boys. So here, and then we have Gwyn and the boys. Wrong. Don't. Oh, okay. From Paris. I wish younger brother. Okay, younger brother is important. Uh, we we also have once famous mother. Hmm. Like that would work with Gwyn Root Tree, right? Gwyn and the boys. I th at first I thought it was like cousins of Gwyn, but well, let's just put him here, I guess. So let's put Ron and Robert in here. Which then this is this really calls into. Oh no, no, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. Th this is actually correct. This is perfect. N remember the alliteration comment um, before where Gwyn and Walter... It's actually like a long time ago. This is probably not even the same video. Uh, it's in the second episode where 
I found a thing that said, oh, we're going with alliterative names, and they freaking did. So there we go. Uh, I mean, kids, they don't have a big age difference from their photos, seemingly, but we're just going to put the left one there, the right one there. A screen director, I guess. Director. Yeah, I, I thought I read, I thought I searched Brother Troll before, but I guess they never cared about that line enough. And yeah, but I don't know what raw. Ra oh, television. Okay, also writer, I guess. Or not also, but we can write screenwriter in there. Okay, okay. Kenelope Tessa Green. That is a name in. Oh. Okay, I got two things. Uh, I don't know how this is going to be relevant. Laugh Lounge. Kenelope and Jack watching. I don't. Hmm. Oh, I think I might have, um... Oh, yeah, I saw this in my very first vid I th video, I think. Just that the save data, uh, the save reset meant that I forgot about those. Guess I didn't happen to need them for most of this list, but... I don't know, this doesn't seem that relevant. Oh, I searched Dr. Wilson, and... Dr. Wilson got brought up in the Carolyn Morden wall of text there, and I didn't expect that to... So this one apparently found a way to game the search results. So Dr. Wilson was called completely bogus by uh, Carolyn Morden. I don't know if I can write that anywhere though, unless it's this. I think it's the it's the stupid def definition of brother-in-law. It's annoying because I think it's supposed to mean that Dr. Stephen Wilson is here. Hello. And the Wilson kids, where no one looks happy. Um, but Jason, that would be the middle child. Um, no. Probably the younger child, yeah. Well, I don't know. Why can I not click that? Well, whatever. There you go. Okay. Uh, let's just, like, eyeball the f ages of them by, I guess, their tallness or something. i put that. Steven Wilson. That would be Zach Wilson. The youngest would be Jason, and this one would be Jim Wilson by having no one else. Okay. Let's, um, I don't know. College? There you go. Okay. So we can actually use those as, like, easy confirmations later on. Stephen Wilson removed. Finally, I I took I put I swapped the order of those pictures. By the way, okay, uh, just to try to confirm. And yes, that is in fact James Rooftree, and that was originally Clark. So I'm not sure why that didn't work before. Maybe I got the job wrong. But yeah, anyway, let's see if we can get anything off Wilson's. It nope. Okay, nothing here. And Zach, also nothing. Well, for speaking of Zach, I wanted to. No, why? You think we get results from freaking the second president of the candy company? So they mentioned Bonnie, Bonnie being a cousin of Carolyn, and I think it goes here because like, why would there be three Hudsons? Well, hmm, that would force Guy Hudson to be actually quite young, huh? Oh well, I'm gonna put these here for now. I'm not sure if I'm actually right with any of these. Nothing, God damn it. Nothing here either. Yeah, this directly precede Carl Rootree. That is what misled me to thinking it was like a direct fa father son relationship or something, but no. It just means that Ernie Jr. is president number four, which would force Guy Hudson to be president three. This is confusing as to where the Madsen family is into this though. Probably in here where I still don't know. So I clearly did not read this revisiting the diary page well enough. Ernie and the kids are lucky to have her. And her children seem eager. Okay, so this part, the children of Sam, uh, Samantha, are Ernie Jr. and Gwyneth. So that would mean, you know what? That probably means Gwyneth. This is Ernie, like, er, just Ernest Madsen. And then Ernie Jr. Because, like, well, it wouldn't be a junior without, you know, a non junior. And that would be President Four. Well, unless there's another Madsen. Nicole Madsen. Um. Yeah, there doesn't actually seem to be another Madsen, um, but I was thinking what if Ernest Madsen was this one instead? Well, I don't know. They also mention EC a lot. That is probably one of the mystery names that are in this dotted area. I don't know. So now that we filled in, like, this stuff especially, and we know that's the Wilson family, I think that I've misplaced this stuff. Like, I think it's actually like a Hudson that goes up here, uh, Guy Hudson, and then what are these? I think those are Davy and Davy and Bethany go here. Uh, so Bethany's yearbook picture, Davy's younger sister, and then this would be David third. 
So that's how it would make sense because it's not going to be a male and a male in this family tree. However, we still lack pictures and I'm going to fix this to president. So then we can put that there. Um, isn't one of these Stephanie? This is a no Why can't I click? There you go. I, but I can't add more pictures to Stephanie. That's annoying. Unless it's a different Stephanie somehow, but I don't think it is. That's kind of a guess, really. Uh, I don't know. I'm getting absolutely nothing from Kellogg. Search it. So then we have this stuff about Sam's display image of Patsy. Black hair, green eyes. Okay, I guess only one of them has actual black hair. What job? It's not gonna be- is it gonna be Housewife again? Because they mentioned that all female, um, root trees at, at that point, in some point in the diary, were housewives. Or do we go with engineer or something? Which is not even on the list, my gosh. Farmer, maybe. I feel like students, some of these. Oh, there we go. Okay. The farmer was correct. There we go. Okay, Christopher Hudson was correct. Ernest Madsen. There we go. <laughs> like, using kids as <laughs> ways to meta around with the confirmation system 10 out of 10. <laughs> we have six left for the next plot point. I had an idea. Oh my gosh, this is so. This would be great if it was true. This line. Maybe they wanted to go to the only member of the family who looks like a sample of the product. The product of candy. I've always been wondering. <laughs> Who this guy is, considering, like, certainly takes up a lot of a screen. <laughs> That's Zach. <laughs> this photo, also, I don't really understand the four of us stand together. I'm pretty sure that means, uh, Lauren and the brothers, the three brothers. God damn it. Three brothers right here. If so, those are the only connected ones. And I don't know what to put them as. That's kind of guesswork. And then we, what, we have Miracle Root Tree, is that it? Hmm. I don't know, we don't know if would start wearing glasses in that photo. So I've already marked a lot, uh, Elias C for other reasons here, which leaves only one left. Is that Angelica Morden then? Well, they could be that or that and I wouldn't know. Or that or here. I also wonder why does this person look purple and and are you James Rootree? <laughs> that must be the water damage, I don't know. Oh, uh Clark. Clark Mary Jane. I didn't remember, I didn't notice or put that in as important info, but I guess it is there. So no, these are not the LaRue kids. <laughs> I think that's why. And and one of these is Jane and one of these is Diamond. Not that I freaking know which is which, but there you go. I added them in. I was searching for Sam Catrall because that is a name that comes up early on, which also has a Stephanie, which, okay, you know, that's definitely suspicious. Stephanie Catrall, an only child, as it was mentioned. So it might be one of these. If so, it would be in this order. Sam Catrall and Stephanie Catrall as an only child. That's the only thing that makes sense to me why, like, I would be able to put a picture here. Well, that didn't work. Or I don't have two out of three right. Change this. Oh, there we go. Yes, very good, very good. And I knew it had to be one of the two there. All right. Sam is right. Gene is right. Even that picture is correct. There we go. Three left. And I technically already kind of have the three left if I fill in these, but I don't want to for confirmation reasons. We also know that this is not... Whoever that purple uh, person is is not James Rootree. And that's not Miracle either. Oh, so you can get someone's non-blood relative right without them. I was wondering if you could. Hmm, for Gwyn Rootree, my father said it was a famous name. There's nothing wrong with Cornwall. But unfortunately, we... <sighs> that's not great, to be honest. I don't think I even know the five pieces, all their names. Just embarrassing. So, in Carolyn Morden's thing, dedicated to Lois and Stephanie. To me, this implies potentially, maybe it's the other Stephanie, but it could be that Alois is the person with, along with Carolyn who raised Stephanie. Uh, and that would be a natural reason why it has dedicated to those two. So I searched Guy Hudson, I didn't do it earlier, I guess, and wife Patricia, that I think that is the most important because we already knew about the crash, but foul play is not suspected. Yeah, and no children. Although, from our position here, we should already know that. So, Patricia Jones, I guess? So this funeral picture, I don't think I ever looked at enough. Um, 
So, like, I didn't really understand who they were referring to and where Ernie's position was, but I think Ernie is here. If that's the case, then this is from Debbie, which is Ernie's wife, I believe. And then Nicole. Student here, okay. I mean, I know Ernie is somewhere in this picture, I just don't know who it is. Like, it could be this guy, or this guy. But I don't know. I'm gonna switch to Clancy's position, by the way. Because I may have gotten it wrong. In revisiting the diary Sam, we have this line about uh, her, the children of Sam have that covered. The glasses, I guess? So children of Sam have glasses. I mean, we actually got two people with glasses in that one. Or no, it would be the, the, the one after that. So... <laughs> So you, you barely. What what are those anyway? And you, that's that's one pre, that's one hell of a president. That doesn't look like the face of someone who wants to stay out of the spotlight. Hmm, I actually only have one Morden left, James Morden. So I guess by elimination, that must be where it is. Oh, we have a Cosell in here. Is that where? Does Lauren mention their mother being the Cosells? And yeah, okay. Elias M's position is definitely wrong here, by the way. I don't know where it is. Like, is it here? Because I, I swear that Elias M is in here, the free spirits, which would mean it would be on this row. Little Quaritch. Nothing. Nothing here. Also, I don't know why this ad says that it has three relevant things in it. Uh, like the names? Do I search those? Nope. That's an old flavor. Nope. What the hell? No, I want to know. So, Rolf Rutree, I'm putting you as student, and hopefully we get a confirm from that one. Yes, okay. So. Okay. So we got Ernest for good. And Rabin. So we only have, like, 17 left to go. And Lois was correct. There we go. So, next time, well, after we see what the, what's going on here. Hello. The candy company. My publisher's lawyers. A book. The truth often isn't kind. That's why you're here. Okay. Well, if you're telling the truth about this, the expert could unearth the whole story. One spot is more important than the rest. Okay. Four! Oh my gosh! If someone has a high number, it's not a mistake. That means that's referring to the numbers in here. Okay, what a twist. They, they're making it harder on you. Damn. Even Notables. I don't know what I could possibly find in Notables anymore, but yeah, okay. Well, there you go. I've made that freaking choice, so now I don't get to use... I don't have as much, you know, leeway with these as I thought I would did. And I didn't even get that much new info information, so I, the freaking endgame's there. All right, bye. Did I ever do this this book, The Sweet History of Candy by Charles Lee? Oh, okay. The Future of Candy, they got everything wrong. And a newspaper ad. Okay, well, I finally get the freaking names of whoever, right? They're inspired by the children. Okay, G-E-C-E-M-M. -M. And you can see the flavors are not the same as they originally were, which is interesting. Like the new flavors are like Sour Apple and Power Plum. I wonder if that's relevant. Um, but yes, Miracle Berries, Mandarin, C E, G E. So M. G E C E M M. So it's definitely G, Gwendolyn. E for Elias. Clancy Edward for C E. Unknown and M for Miracle. So what we need is another M. Okay. <laughs> That's confirmed now. It's the only M name on the tree. But we don't freaking know the freaking, uh,. Well, we know housewife because the lore has said that all Rootree women were housewives up until, like, Lauren Rootree came around. Um, however, we still have a picture! Well, we can... We could 
brute force the pictures, I guess. It's a little unsatisfying, but I genuinely have looked for episodes, and um, I've looked across like three episodes and have not been able to find a way to distinguish the two. So there you go. That's a 50% chance to be wrong. I also noticed it was called The Sweet History Volume 2. So, is there a Volume 1? Yes. Good to know. And extremely early due to a major misprint. Is there a Volume 3? There is not. Okay. Let's use the, let's get the extra five pieces ad. The first ad. Okay. Spelling error. Egg, I mean, oops, not those. Oh, they changed it from... Haha! <laughs> That's not the... A, a valuable everywhere. No way. It's because egg cream is cursed. And the real name is Edward Cl Well... Hmm, weird. Because Edward Clancy... We mentioned this is a, a mistake. We've seen that as a mistake a, a long time ago. And I wonder if it is really just a mistake. Or if there is someone named Edward Clancy instead. Well, wait, no. EC is for... Maybe it's just Elias C? Hmm, that's very weird. What's the difference? This EC thing, too, has been mentioned elsewhere. This other person could be Edward Clancy. Okay, so I just... I looked at Watchmen of the Year like this. I feel like I was supposed to discover this way earlier on, but then I, like, clicked Watchmen of the Year. And this is, like, a magazine, an entire magazine I didn't freaking know. Oh my gosh, this entire thing I just missed, and it was, like, early, early as hell in the game. Okay, so... This should have every, like, leader of... cover? Every leader of the candy company should be there, I think. At least. Okay. Here we go. Carl Root Tree. And that's how we're supposed- oh my gosh. Uh, not chosen for work at Root Tree, but uh, rather clothing company Root. I guess it's a little bit something for a good recap. Because the early game was about this candy company. Uh, the- the very first Root Tree created a candy company. Uh, Brendan, fashion consultant, we already knew this, though. Reyna was born. And Brenda's patterns were being copied. So, Carl spent a lot to bankroll the clothing company, and at first did not support this other venture, okay? What about Ernie Jr.? Okay, due to heart illness, Ernie Jr. is stepping down, and Cousin Carl will take over. Maple Crisp. And none of this, to me, is new information, but it is important. It would have been important if I didn't know. It would have been very useful. And what about Ernie Madsen, the, is their dad? A little is known about Ernest. And originally, Ernest trained to succeed Zach Morden, the Batter Up Bar. We have not seen that Batter Up Bar. We're gonna probably copy-paste that. But first, let's search Zach Morden. I can't believe we don't have a picture of freaking Zach Morden. Son of James and Gwendolyn Morden. We will not be making any change. I think there were some changes. Well, not when Zach was really around. Anyway, son of James and Gwendolyn? Is that true? That would have... Uh, I don't know. Maybe... I don't know if that makes much sense. Morden instead of Root Tree. Because there is actually someone else named Gwendolyn. Who I proved to put as Morden. Okay, let's search the, the, another failed thing. Give me imitation. Okay, powdery chunks. <laughs> Chest fight improved. So do we have anything about Elias root tree, which is the first root tree? Okay. Notice from the article in the scan, okay. That's... Wow. People look different when they grow, grow mega mustache, I don't know. Oh, it's a painting. Um, <laughs> Elias forms in 1908. The company's barely profitable. A daughter, four more follow. It starts in Pittsburgh, or get rolled out to all of New England. The new recipe is finalized. Is that Miracle Root Tree? I think it is. Miracle Root Tree came way later. Well, no. Not exact. I don't know. Something's weird because I, I have the suspicion that this was actually a sixth piece. Uh, the EC that was left out, perhaps. Um, Elias's architecture, I already knew they are architecture firm. Production is tripled. And what's next section with the Clans Trust? That makes sense. And I have known about the Clans Trust. That it was basically a contract to keep uh, and give blood relatives money and also incentivize them to stay with the candy company. There is nothing for Elias C or M. Yeah, there is not. Whoops. Junior is also nothing. The Clans Trust is relevant. Infallible, of course. I've already found the other details online. I don't think that's going to be useful. Edward, freaking... God damn it. 
Roostray Motors, maybe? That's relevant. Come on, that's a company that's been around for 50 years, according to its ad. Okay, so I, I know Edward... Clancy Edward Roostray is a lawyer. And in here it says, um, Edward is even set to take over Pop's department once Pop retires. In other words, lawyer again. Here we go. And I just wish I knew what I was doing. Doctor? I don't know. Oh, I also forgot... I Hudson. Okay, so... Ah, I wish I had a freaking image, but... Twin sister... Oh, I didn't know that. Is, why is Boys and Girls capitalized? Is that a thing? Oh, Boys and Girls Agree era. Oh, shh. Hmm. But yes, I already have most of it here. I guess Bonnie Hudson is their twin sister. Please give me an image so I can confirm these people. Okay, Boys and... Ads. The bright red hair of the boy and girl. Of... Okay, here we go. Here, the pose besides that Rootry is her favorite. Amazing. Um, very likely Guy and Bonnie. Though I don't know what Bonnie's job is. It's hard to say like what someone's job is when they've already lived a life. I guess advertising, but we <sighs> that probably wouldn't be their actual primary. It's also kind of cursed to have these photos, like we're just slapping together whatever photo we find of them, even if they look nothing like them in the present day or as an adult. It's time to arbitrarily swap it around so that uh this is the house. This... Not rewarded. What is this root tree chocolate? Like, is it something new? Why? Oh, whatever. I don't know, like, some, somehow this camera must have been worse than the previous generation camera. It's also funny that, like, this first picture is in color. It's probably was, like, originally black and white then colored for the, that lore to make sense. As this one's black and white, this one is... Look, we're looking for redheads, I think. So Bonnie would be that if I didn't already have a picture there. To be quite honest, I should just like like arbitrarily associate pictures at this point. Remember, this is a distinct mustache. This brother trouble thing is this sitcom. It actually should be in the Teen Blast magazine. At least I think it would be. Okay, I don't think I've seen this before. Um, is TMS the new root tree? Yes, it, we do know that. And what about this Penelope? Ron is a distant relative. Yes, yes, this is freaking from an unexpected place. Ron married Penelope, who played TMS mom on the show. My gosh. Here's Ron. Here's Penelope. You could see this picture from a long, long time ago. But was, we're never really able to do anything about it until now. So, two? Hmm, two. Eight. Newborn. And newborn is 1997, so that's way younger. Uh-huh, okay. So the newborn goes there, and this is Jack Rooptree, who is currently living out the temporary utopia as a baby. Okay, no, not baby. Wait, is it Nicole, actually? Um, the... Wait, I swear I heard the word Nicole. Well, I don't know. Um, but you're like a student or whatever. You think November Rooptree is... I don't know. That's interesting. Because just remember that this has the free spirits. It says November, and maybe that's a babe, that baby and not like a company name because there is someone else in November. I don't know. But November doesn't quite fit it anyway. Should you just picture swap again just in case? Oh, oh my gosh. They were, they were correct before. Okay, good, good, good. Uh, that was ridiculous. All right. Penelope's gone. Okay. That picture is good. Right. I don't understand why it says that Clark is- this page is three things that I can do with it. Like, three things I can search. Is it Jane LaRue? Uh, is it, like, Clark? Yeah, we've seen that already. Yeah, I've already seen this. I gotta switch around these again. Maybe I was wrong with who was Clancy and whatever. I mean, I know this is wrong, though. I don't know. It's not intuitive I'm doing that. I swear November Root Tree is on this row. This is... And I only have one unknown on it. That has to be, like, the young-looking... Weirdly young-looking person. I don't know. Maybe they're just short. I don't know. And the baby wouldn't have that much hair. But I just don't know who that is. Why is there no house husband in here for, a for like, Eli C.? the time where I have to capture everyone's face now because I mean what else is there to do I can vaguely guess that the older ones would be on the left side but that's all 
Hey, one of them literally has Ella. Oh my gosh, if I took the picture earlier, we would have found it. Um, that's probably Lys M, although job's still unknown. <sighs> that's just a guess there. Gosh, I have no idea. You you look very similar to this. Just, it's not even on the right side, but they're like related enough, like maybe. I also have no idea. Like, yes, I can take this picture, but I've never been able to get results on Rootree Motors. I could guess that, like, I don't know, it just doesn't really fit the family tree. Where would Tessa root tree be on it? Basically, everything else is filled. I'm concerned about those. Those, all the yellow, of course, I'm certain about. This one is the weird one, but that's also not in the right section, is it? But I guess this is the only one it could be. Even though it doesn't give you an opportunity to add extra photos. Oh, well. I'm Catherine Wilkins, which I don't know about. I feel like I should try to trigger another potential... Nope. I mean, I know that one's correct, so then I'm missing three still. I'm missing a perfect three. I know who you are. Hmm. There's also not many root trees left in the list, even. Is that also you? It's weird because of the four of us stand together part. Kind of a mess if they're not really together in the photo. I've also just been putting random people in the non-blood relative because I've not found any info on them. And you have like seven magazines to search from at this point. Oh, uh, Clara and I plan to perfect it. Okay, Clara. All right, there we go. I guess at this one again. I don't know who you are, though. There's some, I guess this is a guess works slightly, but LIC raised Clark and Jim's brothers... Um, now I thought that Eli C was the youngest. I mean, it seemed like Edward and Clancy weren't doing their jobs. I don't know. But if you think about it, that means that Elias would have had to worry about James, Clark, and their own son slash daughter. So maybe it's, maybe they got the order wrong this whole damn time. But this, it's still Edward, Elias, and Clancy in this shot. And <sighs> so then Edward would be the lawyer. Oh, then I have no picture for Clancy. This is whoa! Wait, hold on. Um, that isn't what I expected. That. <sighs> okay, so actually, I got the baby correct. I think I got okay. I got a lucky. Wow, I got really lucky on the the, the spouses. I think. Okay. Wow, luck does it again. Or well. I don't know. I don't know if it's done it that well in... I think it done is done decently well in this playthrough, but wow. So that is some trash, honestly. Because in here, it says they insisted the four of us stand together. Edward is... No, not Edward. I mean, Clancy. I guess the, the glasses fit the professor look a little bit more, but that is so far off the center. That does not fit the description at all. I was going to select the other one. <sighs> Also, Tessa's position on this is definitely wrong now, and then Wilkins is also wrong. I'm confused though, Eli- on Miracle's side of the film, there's supposed to be an Elias M somewhere. The Free Spirit says that it's a signature here, but clearly if that were true, then Elias needs to be in this position to be on the same row and part of Miracle's family. So maybe I just don't know their job, and the worst part is this is one of the slots that Tessa could have been, because Tessa is in like an only child who, who needs to be, uh, have a mother in the Wilkins family. Okay, also this picture is definitely wrong. Oh, or, or you. You look even younger though. It's ridiculous. And your job is still wrong. I don't know what the hell your job was. Oh, freaking housewife. Jeez, this is dumb. Well, now that's done. Revisiting the diary, Clark has lost some intuition hint points. Hint points is not the right word, but like clues to how useful it is. The current most useful is that one about names. <sighs> What a, what a great, what a great one. Are you kidding me? That, this, you, you, you do that as if this was a, a, more like a normal search engine, but you can't search for anyone's father by typing father in it. So why would you expect that to work? Ah, oh well. Well, let's see if this is any useful. One of the, it's called Sun. There blazed a spark of light that ever brightly shone. From her starting days so it says the lyrics of the song contain no clues, but then here it doesn't say that. Unknown. Though someday she'd depart in part, I'd never be alone. In my heart I'll always be the son of... 
gonna rhyme with the low. <laughs> it's not even a good rhyme, and I lucked my way into it anyway, but Joan Mar Monroe. There you go. Um, oh, here, look, oh my gosh. Okay, look at this. Eli, Miracle's youngest, not my brother, to even chimed in. Sam gave, wait, Sam? Ah, damn, that doesn't help as much as I, as I thought. I thought it would be the mechanic clue for Tessa, but no, it didn't work. Definitely isn't Tessa here. We also have the whole, uh, Gwyneth is the green thumb of her mother. This is Gwyneth. And so... Maybe farmer instead of housewife? I don't know. Freaking no one else is a farmer in this <laughs> besides Samantha. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna make this, even though it doesn't make any sense. Like, I genuinely have no idea where else I would put this, so... Mechanic, Tessa. My gosh, but why? <laughs> Oh, you were a house. My gosh. Two housewives. There we go. And okay. I'm at 45 now. Okay, so freaking why is this Elias M here? Now, I get that Elias has a reason to be a mechanic, which is interesting. But this picture, if it, what is Eli M doing here? That's the third generation, but Elias is in the second row. Or I keep saying second row when, like, I don't count the zeroth row of... Gwyneth and Elias here. It also means that whatever Elias is doing is wrong, but it could be mechanic, just like Tessa was. That would make sense. We have very little in here now. Is it April? I don't know what the heck it... <laughs> well, it's gonna stay a root tree, I... maybe. November root tree? That would be you? Student? It also means I failed Elias C wrong, but I don't know... I still... It's so annoying that I have no info about Elias C. The only info I have is that the, um, Lauren called the brothers uh, doing useful things for society. So, oh, it's a, probably not musician. You're, you look like a travel agent to me. <laughs> I would like to put something in for Bonnie Hudson, but I don't know if that's the one. I also have, are, did you put on sunglasses? I don't know. I'm finally going to fill in David. I've already knew, known David is very likely a student, unless... I also am going to get memed by the college one, but I've been saving it till the end for better, uh, you know, metagaming with the con uh, confirmation. I mean, the other... I'm just going to freaking... <laughs> yeah, comedian. I'm sure that's it. Politics. Nope. <sighs> Pro athlete. Yes. Okay, so this took absolutely forever to find, but choreography by November Studios. Yeah. Yeah, so... November, there's like very little info. This is kind of a leap in logic, I guess you could say, but dance school. And and we also heard um, that the people in the third generation uh, were like freaking dancers and artists and stuff. So dancer. Oh, come on. That just that just leaves like other, three other people. I don't know. I'm going to have to go through this again. <laughs> Baby. Housewife. Also first present. God damn it. Oh, I forgot this. Oh my gosh. I'm glad. I'm very, very glad. Uh, swims. I forgot. Completely. So, wait. I call it whatever. Yeah, this is not a swimming. There's no swim job. All right. Do I have this? Everything else correct now? Architect. Oh! Okay, okay, okay. Awesome, awesome. I almost skipped it, too. Uh. Yeah. Well, who is EC? Oh, damn. Whenever you're ready. Wait, John. No, there was someone else named John, but. Hmm. I think it's that. But what is this? Be sick if this was someone who we already listed. That'd be great. Like a double life. And there's a picture to put. I guess I, oh my gosh, I haven't put, uh, now having that picture sitting around is bad. Although that implies we had a picture of EC laying around. What? I was not gonna, I'm not gonna re-click a picture, huh? We also have this mystery still. The whole new, uh, someone who thinks that their dad is Clancy. So it's a look-alike of Clancy at the very least. I mean, or, like, this is this line about Sam having to grow up in a house with Mr. Miller as well. Oh, that wouldn't make any, like, we do probably want to research Mr. Miller, but the thing is that would not explain the 
girl who thinks Edward is their pop. Hmm. That'd be Samantha? I don't... Hmm. Alongside the farmhands, E.C. and John. Ugh. The other thing is this doesn't quite work with my uh, six-piece theory idea. Unless they're gonna freaking magic out. Nah, something's still weird here. Because this would imply that they made a baby and that became Edward Clancy Rootree. But, I don't know. It's a little weird. Like, no, you can't take a picture of the news guy. <laughs> Edward Clancy Rootree would have to be freaking 90 or something if I was still alive. <laughs> but personally, if it were me... God damn it, you, like, you don't even get anything when you click that. I would do something where it was a surprise uh, where the last click was and it wasn't obvious. It's annoying that I... <sighs> Let's take this guy. Maybe change the filter a little bit. And there you go. I, I don't know, I'm gonna click I'm ready now. Confirm, my gosh. <sighs> Okay. Oh, did I get lucky with those? Next for left, next time. One. Get ball. Take a picture right now. What? Huh. Hmm. <laughs> I mean, it is the most obvious answer. But there is, who else did I ever see that was easy unless the, the hiddenness was way more than I thought. To be like, my master plan worked. Man, yep. Yes. Ah, my father's, yep, okay. Yeah, well, duh, Lawrence Didari is like the best, you know? Um... And John Miller. Interesting. I wasn't sure if John Miller actually had that much involvement, but seems like it is. Elias locked, um... Uh, yeah. It was freaking, like, 1920 at the time or something. Mm. <laughs> I love the, the list of stuff at the left, even though I've actually seen most of them already. Yep. What? Grrr. Wow, I did not see that. I mean, I thought it could be in that picture, but I didn't click it. Wow. Curse. Never learn truth or receive inheritance. Oh, I've never... Wait, I never saw this freaking book at all. Freaking damn it. Right. A real root tree. I thought Ernie Jr. did get it, but I guess, like, um, Guy got it first. Oh, no. 36? Wow, I did not think the luxuries of the typical. Even that part? My gosh. Right, I remember there was um a, a piece of thing that said, yeah, the, the one that's like the company took care of us beyond our wildest expectations. Freaking finally. That, yeah. Blood relative. Yes, which means that you're coming back for... Oh, you didn't get anything either? Mm. Okay. Okay. Cool. So that's 100%, isn't it? Like, besides, oh, you missed a one picture. Freaking spaghetti monster. Not sure anything will change. I mean, yeah, I guess if I freaking clicked around, I might have been able to find it. My gosh. Well, there you go.